won this 6000 rupees meta bat completely for free wait you got that for free surprise here is all can we please have a huge round of applause and can we please welcome prince sir and arun sir before we are moving forward uh, let's talk about what is meta shot the company like that is redefining the way that we experience cricket This isn't a regular bat. It's powered by mixed reality technology that blends virtual elements with the real world. So we are here to present the challenges faced uh, during the meta shot activity. So first we can add our feature which is very bold. Personalized commentary will be provided in multiple languages. We can add something like glove which can be used to ball. And that's how I won the 6000 rupees meta bat. What does it take to build a product around mixed reality? A deep tech startup like MetaShot? Let's explore everything in the video directly from the co-founder to the chief technology officer. Uh, so good evening sir it's an honor meeting you and welcome to nst pune so my first question to you is uh, what was the biggest challenge in making xr or mr cricket feel real the biggest uh, problem we are facing is to meet the expectation of user yeah they they have the bat or in vr also they have the controller so they expecting okay we can play every direction every shot and uh, the other thing is how they feel that shot like uh, after a shot it's a, it's a six we have to provide the feeling power of yeah, the bat yeah, yeah. yeah that's a hitting hitting effect mm -hmm. so we can we can provide by via haptic okay you just uh, play hit the shot and uh, we can feel that haptics just a vibration and things and the other one another one is uh, as, as you said is yeah. a cheering is immersive feel the audio audio of this stadium you are in the stadium that helps the people to immerse in that environment so how does meta shot uh, recreate real world cricket physics in virtual environment in meta shot we are collecting the data from the bat okay the sensor is a sensor based game so we collect the data from the bat in that particularly we collect the accelerometer data oh. so based on the movement of the bat the accelerometer data is varying so based on that we can detect the we, we detect the shot uh, power of the shot what kind of data does meta shot collect you know to make the mr or xr cricket uh, feel more smarter or more realistic we collect the sensors data mm -hmm. so based on that uh, we actually mirroring the bats movement in virtual world mm -hmm. so player uh, player can just rotate Swing every uh, yeah, yeah every every direction mm -hmm. you say in real life bat how real world bat movement that we can replicate mm -hmm. the movement in virtual world in that case the um, we collect the data is a basic the sensor data like uh, accelerometer magnetometer and uh, gyrometer data yeah. so the gyrometer is we are using for the how where where we are facing the angle of the bat and for accelerometer is just uh, i already said the power for yeah. the power and uh, we peak the data means uh, how power we need for that shot those kind of data we we collect some analytics yeah, we played tested all, all the shots and uh, all the bowling conditions then we collect those data to this this is the limit we can make uh, uh, shots based on this data this numbers this power shot will go to 6 and so we analyzing those data from the sensors and we also analyzing how the player choose um, play with uh, with that kind of bowling timing is a uh, one thing okay mm -hmm. so in in spinners and fast bowling the bowling timing is different so player have to adopt the timing we collect those data also how the players just responds to the fast bowling and how the how the swing how they respond to the swing and how the spin so we collect that data to balance the game thank you so much sir it was fun interacting with you yeah. and getting to know the tech part behind the meta shot yeah, thank you for having me now that we know how the tech works let's rewind a bit where did the idea even come from for that 
Let's hit the turf with Prince, the founder of Metashot. Uh, what is your earliest memory of playing cricket? Like any experience you would like to share, sir? I think the first memory that I have of cricket is my father giving me a small bat, and you know he got a ball as well, and mm -hmm. he taught me how to hit that shot. Okay, the and I think it? the shot hit some frame okay. in my grandfather's house, and uh, you know, so that is the first memory I have. Prince, sir, cricket is just more than a sport in India. Uh, so, how difficult was it to convince people to play real cricket with a VR bat, sir? So, uh, we never claim that we are a replacement to real cricket. We always say that this is an addition to the cricket that you are playing. Absolutely. And uh, for us, the concept is that, you know, this is an introduction to the game of cricket to youngsters, like, I mean, to kids. And reintroduction of cricket to those who cannot play cricket now. Right. So we never say that, you know, we are uh, an alternative to actual cricket. If you get time to play actual cricket, mm -hmm. please play that only. So, sir, cricket is a game full of feelings. The intensity of shots you are pulling, the weight of the bat. So how does Metashot make sure this with the help of MR? From the beginning, we always, whenever we did the product, longer term goal is to make it more immersive, you know, get it more closer to real game. Mm -hmm. But like I always say, never a replacement to real game. Right, sir. So, sir, what were some crazy technical break breakthroughs you had while building Metashot? So, I think one of the things that uh, initially we faced the challenge was, how can you give a 360 degree uh, playing field to a user. Right. The problem with that was that, you know, until then we only had five shots in the game. So, from there to making it unlimited angles and unlimited areas of the play, of the field, I think that was a major breakthrough. This happened in March 2022. If you had unlimited resources with you, so what is that one feature you would like to enable in Metashot or in the same arena? I mean, with unlimited uh, resources, we would like to fast track the entire list of uh, feedbacks that we have got from our customers. Mm -hmm. I think there is a huge list. There are a lot of good ideas. Uh, customers constantly talk to us. Uh, so instead of building a new feature, no, all these things which customers have asked, which we feel are also relevant, we'll fast track that given unlimited uh, resources and time. Uh, how do you uh, see MR tech ev evolving in the next five years, sir? I think uh, MR will live its uh, life in the next five years, complete its life cycle. And I feel more advanced uh, technology like VR, etc., which is already there, will become more mass accessible. And once that happens, you know, the immersive experiences will only grow for the end customer. Right. And we also plan to get into that uh, space as, as soon as it becomes accessible to everyone. Right. So I feel MR will go through a change where, you know, it's a transitionary phase. But, you know, VR and other more advanced uh, ways of immersion will take over. Definitely. Bring home the sport. For more such exciting content, subscribe to Newton School of Technology ADYPU. Stay, Stay tuned. tuned.